And what I'm going to show you today is a demonstration with gun cotton and a little bit of history about it. Um, it got its name because it was originally used as a form of a type of gunpowder in ammunition and artillery rounds in the military. Back in the 1880s, it was invented by a French chemist. And it's another combustion reaction, like Blake said. And what makes this different than other reactions like the combustion reaction in your car engine is in your car engine, you have the gas and the oxygen, which acts as an accelerant, and you have to combine them together at separate times. With this, um, we have nitrated the cellulose in the cotton in here, and so now you have nitrocellulose, is what you would, um, what you would call it. And basically what's gonna happen is the accelerant and the fuel are combined in the same piece, so it's gonna be a very fast combustion, combustion reaction. And just to give y'all, is there a lighter somewhere? Just to give y'all an example of what the cotton burns like without the accelerant already combined in here. Um, is it somewhere? Are we done with the lighters? I have matches. I have this. No, that'll work. All right, so. What you're gonna see is, without the nitrate combined to the cellulose, this burns very slow, and it almost looks like a marshmallow burning, but very, <laughs> very, very boring. So, what happens with gun cotton is the nitrate combined to the cellulose inside the cotton, it's actually going to make it combust fairly quickly, so I wish I had a longer lighter, but we'll see how it goes. So this is going to combust pretty quickly. So there you go. And that was a fast combustion. And what we're going to do now, uh, Dr. Lawrence calls this the Christmas tree of death. And I might be using too much cotton here, but if you could imagine, this would be like, let's say tinsel on a Christmas tree. And you're, we're just gonna drape it around. But what I'm about to add to this is potassium pentoxide, which it reacts with water pretty violently. So it's gonna create a very high heat. And the heat is actually gonna be strong enough to uh, combust the cotton again and it's just gonna be lit with water so I'm not even gonna need the lighter again and this is pretty harsh stuff so you don't want to get it on you Let's see. No gloves. <laughs> and we're just gonna put a little bit on the cotton right here all right now we're gonna take our water <coughs> And let's move this out of the way. So I'm just going to squirt it with water. It's going to create a very hot reaction. It's going to light the whole tree on fire. And there you go.